10 most entertaining YouTube basketball players. With the NBA arenas closed to business due to the pandemic, it's nice to have another option for getting your basketball fix whenever you need it. These guys are fun to watch, talented, give workout tips, show you new moves, and compete in random challenges. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Also, hit the bell icon button so that you'll get a notification whenever we post a new video. Number 10, Filet. Filet, also known as Jesse Jones, is the total package, but his smooth finishes off the backboard are probably the most entertaining thing in his arsenal to watch. Filet also has super fast cuts and outstanding hang time around the rim. He shoots quite a bit of pickup games and street games, but he also has experience with playing pro in a Canadian league. Basketball aside, he has great charisma and the dude is not a bad singer. For real, great pipes, Filet. Number 9. Chris Staples. Okay, maybe Chris Staples is a little one-dimensional, but that one dimension is pretty damn good. If you want to see some of the best dunks on YouTube, check out his channel. He also runs some five-on-fives, one-on-ones, dunk contests, and king of the courts. Not only is he one of the top dunkers on YouTube, he can straight up hoop too. Number eight. Nick Breeze. Speaking of dunking, Nick Breeze dunks like a madman in his videos and his hang time is insane. He can take off from the free throw line, throw in some pumps or a windmill, and finish strong over the rim. His jump shots look a little unconventional, but it's accurate. His channel is starting to blow up, so he just needs to put out more content to get to that next level. Number 7. Hoop in Life, Nelson Chan. Hoop in Life, or Nelson Chan, is extremely quick and fun to watch. What he lacks in size, he makes up for in hustle, dexterity, and handles. He also has has a great hesitation move and can explode past the defender. He prides himself as the short guy who can ball and he can back up his claim. His channel has more of an international feel to it and has some diversity if you are looking for something a little different. He isn't afraid to play against actual competition and has one-on-one -on -one some of the best YouTubers out there. Number 6. Devonte Friga. What everyone likes about his channel is that he runs a lot of fives. He doesn't have a lot of fluff, parodies, or non-basketball related content. He just runs games and uploads them. He will play anyone one-on-one. -on -one. He isn't afraid to show a loss to another YouTuber, and he doesn't make excuses. He played D3 basketball, so he is a legit hooper. He has a very well-rounded game and can score from anywhere on the court. If you are looking for a basketball YouTuber who actually sticks to basketball, Devante will deliver. Number 5. Christopher London, LSK. Chris London played college hoops, was playing towards a possible future in the NBA, but his career was plagued by injuries, so he eventually turned to YouTube. His time on YouTube has turned out nicely for him, racking up over 2 million subscribers on his main channel. He is a complete player who can do it all, with a lengthy 6'10 frame. It's pretty rare to find a player with his height who can shoot beyond the arc with his accuracy and get around smaller players with his ball handling and crossovers. Number 4. T-Jazz, Tristan Jass. His YouTube channel, home of the Crazy Lay, is nearing 2 million subscribers thanks to his outlandish layups, trick shots, and sometimes comical delivery. Although he has a small frame, 5'11", he has a complete package. It's it's scary to think how good he would be if he added another 6 inches more to his height. His handles are no joke either. He is very creative and unorthodox in his dribbling, and you better not sleep on his jumper. TJAS is one of those players who can pull out a layup or shot at the hoop that I promise you have never seen before. Number 3. AJ Lepre. This is a YouTuber who can put together a really entertaining 5v5 pickup game against random players, but he has a D1 college pedigree. Having played at Oregon, Pepperdine, and Rice. AJ has a complete game. Dangerous shooter on the perimeter, great handles, strong in the post, and can play defense, but not his priority when he really wants to. He has a great series of videos where he trolls players on Venice Beach, posing as a surfer or a nerd just before he lights them up. LaPrey is also a natural in front of the camera, which only adds to his appeal on YouTube. Number two, The Bone Collector. This guy has had a long career and is the OG of basketball YouTubers, but the Bone Collector is still going strong. He has a streetball background and developed his style playing at Rucker Park and the And One Tour. He isn't afraid to challenge anyone to a 1v1, including NBA legends and guys half his age. His handles are tight, extremely fast, and he finishes strong around the hoop. Guarding the Bone Collector can't be fun. He will spin you around and have you hobbling on broken ankles. Number one, The Professor. The Professor, hands down, is the greatest and most entertaining basketball YouTuber on the net. This global hooper phenom got his start in And One and then transitioned into YouTube with his Professor Live channel. If you want to see some jaw-dropping handles, ankle-breaking crossovers, alley-oops, and lightning-fast moves, check out his YouTube videos. His Spider-Man series that went viral a few years ago is a must-watch for everyone, even if you aren't into basketball or streetball. He also has an accurate jump shot and can play shutdown defense when he really needs to, despite his 5'10 frame. The Professor has made a variety of videos in several different 
different countries and even shot some games he played in prison against inmates. He also posts content ranging from tutorials to product reviews. His best videos are definitely the ones where he leaves his opponents lying flat on their back on the court. So there are 10 ballers on YouTube to get you started, but there are much more out there to check out. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Also, hit the bell icon so that you'll get a notification whenever we post a new video.